Good afternoon, I'm Alicia Smith and here are your headlines from 7 Action News. We are following a suspicious death in Canton. Investigators say that a woman was found in her home in the 4100 block of Kimberly Drive around 745 this morning. Now this is located off of Geddes Road west of Canton Center Road. Of course, we'll bring you more information as soon as it becomes available. Many younger students are back in their classrooms today in Novi. This is all part of the governor's push for all districts across the state of Michigan to resume in-person instruction by next Monday, March 1st. Many students in kindergarten through sixth grade have been going to class a few days a week, but now they're back to five days a week. The district spent the last two and a half weeks preparing the classrooms. Gas prices took a big jump within the past few days. One reason, that winter storm that disrupted operations at refineries along the Gulf Coast. AAA Michigan says drivers in our state are coping with the largest gas price hike in the country. Right now we're averaging about $2.63 per gallon for regular unleaded. That's about 17 cents higher than just last week. Now here in the Metro Detroit area specifically, the current average is about 264 a gallon, about 16 cents higher than last week's average. AAA says the warm temperatures will help improve refinery operations, but tight supply and high crude oil prices mean that we won't get a break just yet. Thanks, Alicia. We'll stay cloudy for today, but a high temp of 37. We actually already achieved that high temp. Uh, winds are going to be pretty breezy or gusty at times, which means this 37 is probably going to feel like the low 30s to upper 20s at times. Snow is on the way, thinking most areas will pick up about a dusting to an inch.